How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you today as always. I hope you're all having a beautiful day wherever you guys might be. So today I'm super excited because I unlocked black colors for Magyar. That's right. I finally got Magyar to level 25 and where is he? There we go. I already purchased it. I was too excited, but there you go. Black colors for Magyar, which means that I have black colors for every legend in Brawlhalla now. Literally every legend. I'll go through this list really quick so you guys can see for yourself, but there you go. Every single legend, black colors. So that means we're gonna play some games with black colors Magyar. Oh, I almost forgot. I also have a new mod to show off, the Light Forged Greatsword. Check it out. I will leave a link to this mod in the description of the video if you want to get it for yourself. You do have to be on PC, only you can see it, and you do have to have the Phantom of the Armor Magyar, but yeah, otherwise the mod is free, and it is really cool. It even changes colors based on what color you choose. So let's go ahead and look at the different colors or different skins with Black Magyar. We have Phantom of the Armor Magyar, looks amazing. Here's the Golden Gladiator Magyar, looks pretty cool. We have Base Skin Magyar, which we already saw, looks amazing. I love how half of the blade is dark black and the other half is gray, separated by that red line. It looks pretty cool. And then we have Phantom King Magyar, which you notice his eye is actually black until I lock in, then it turns red. Oops. Well, I guess we're using this one. <laughs> I didn't mean to lock in, but there you go. Oh, man. Also, another thing that we can do now that I have black colors for Magyar is we can do a strikeout team of all three Greatsword Legends and in black colors, which I have never seen done before. I, I mean, probably it's been done before. I don't know, but I've never seen it done before personally. All right, going against Jigsaw. Two, three, one. First, actually, technically not my first game with Black Magyar. I have played Magyar a little bit since getting black. He really is uh, patient. He likes to just wait. But we can do that too. Ooh, we got him there. Oh man, if he would have done a recovery, maybe he couldn't. Let's stick to the great sword for now. Take it. He's trying to do a sick to me, I can tell. If he hits me with a down sick, that would hurt. Oh, oh, oh. He almost got me there. Woo! Boom. Oh, we got him with the neutral sig. I actually didn't think I would hit with that, but he kind of jumped into it. Oh man, it feels good. Let's go. Come on, Jigsaw. Don't get, don't get a little bit depressed on me just because you're getting three stock. You gotta keep fighting. Don't ask me how I didn't get hit by that because I have no idea. Ooh. See, sometimes when I go against people that really don't want to approach unless like I leave myself open, I just give them a taste of their own medicine and usually that's all you have to do. GG dude, GG. 
All right. First game recording with the Black Vega is a win. Feels good, dude. GG. All right, so let's show off the actual Light Forge Great Sword. Now, I can use this sword on other skins. I just have to use the Cold Embrace Sword, which is normally the sword that comes with the Phantom of the Armor Magyar, but let's give him a different hammer. Mm. Let's do... I actually really do like the Verdict Hammer. It just looks cool to me. All right, going against Space. Atronics. Space Atronics. I do like that Azuri charged OG with that uh, that Val level 3 sword. It looks pretty cool. Pump some iron, baby. Little bit of patience there, paid off. Got him with that hammer recovery. Missouri can be a bully, but don't let it get you too flustered. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What? My hammer throw went right through her. Unbelievable. Get out of here, Azuri! This is my stage! Lightforge Greatsword looks so cool though, doesn't it? Almost killed me with an unarmed Nair! Oh, I thought I could throw it and dodge to the wall, but... Unfortunately, I could only throw. There we go! Another win with Magyar. Do you guys remember when Magyar first came out? How terrible I was with Magyar? Like, I'm pretty sure I lost every game. I lost every game. And now I pretty much win every game. And it's not like I did anything, you know, crazy. I just played Magyar a lot. I practiced with him a lot. I didn't even really play him to get better. I just played him to play him to level him up to level 25. You know what I mean? And just by doing that, I got a lot better with Magyar, and you could do the same with any legend. That's the point I'm trying to make. All right, so I'm gonna do another game. This time we're gonna go Golden Gladiator Magyar, but we're gonna do Triple Great Sword Strikeout because we can do it with full black colors now. Actually, should I use the Light Forge Great Sword on all three? Yes, yes I will. That hammer is so ugly too. Let's do that one. Triple, we're gonna do the Light Forge Great Sword on all three of these. Just so for sure we get to use it, because I really do love that mod. <laughs> this is the last Magyar skin that I have to do other than the default Magyar, and we'll do a default Magyar as well. But triple black great sword strikeout, baby. This skin actually looks really good with the uh, default hammer. It almost goes better with this skin. Alright, going against. Dr. Too Saucy with Wuxiang, Zariel, and Val. Three Gauntlet Legends versus three Great Sword Legends. All right. Gauntlets versus Great Sword. Let's go. 
All right, I got a hammer, so I guess not so much on the gauntlets versus greatsword, but. That should be death. Oh, he did the neutral sig the wrong way, unfortunately. He had the good idea there. That probably would have got him back. All right, great sword, baby. That down light on great sword is such a good approach move. It covers so much ground. Oh, that was actually a good, good down sick he did. If you like do the down light, boom, boom, wait, they dodge and then read the dodge and then do two more. Get some every time. Even high diamond players, hit them twice with the great sword, then wait for the dodge read. They always dodge after two hits. That's because everybody almost always tries one, two, dodge, and they see. I could have maybe gotten a two more. Man, why are you trying to beat me with just down six? Ooh. Oh! -ho -ho! Sorry, Jay. Uh we're going to Mako now. He's like, wait, another great sword legend? And they're all black? What is this nightmare? Careful, Val, you're gonna get dunked. Never mind. GG, dude, GG. He did down sig facing the wrong way. Like, alright. That's not the first time he did a sig the wrong way, so I don't know what's going on with his controls, but GG, dude, GG. Oh, man. All right, one more game, guys. Last game. This time I'm going to use base skin Magyar. Base skin. In fact, let's just go base skin on all three greatsword legends because I never really do. But we're going to do base skin black colors. All three greatsword legends. And I think when you see all the base skins next to each other, I don't know about you guys, but Magar base skin is one of the best looking base skins in the game, to, in, in my opinion, so... But, they all look pretty good. Alright, last game going against Magnatorius, Val, Isaiah, and Sentinel. What an interesting team combo. Got hammer, blasters, sword, gauntlets, Katar's hammer. Very, very diverse mix of weapons. If I beat Magnatorius, that would mean I won with every single match in this video, right? He is a speedy one, but then again, it is Cassidy. Miss that down air. Hold that, no? The thing about Greatsword is eventually the down light will outreach everything. So, I don't care how, like, ranged defense they're trying to play. I will outrange. It also, like, changes where your body position is, too, which really helps.
surprised he's not going for a neutral sig. With Isaiah, it's so strong. A down sig? Got him. Ooh, we looking at a three stock almost. Maybe we're not even gonna get to use Jayun and uh, Mako. All right, now he's being really patient. So nervous, I could tell. GG. Finish him off with that weapon throw. Was that a three stock? It was. <laughs> I wasn't even really paying attention to that at first, but dang. All right. Sorry, Mako. Sorry, Jayun. The idea was great. The strikes strike out with three great sorted black legends, but we never even really got to use the second or third legends except for that one game. But that's how it is sometimes, the strike out. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please drop a like. Be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content, and as always, I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, guys.